What's up everyone? I'm Alan Kavana for Speed Sport. It was a great weekend of racing and if you missed anything, you are in the right place. This is your Gas and Go presented by Cometic Gasket. Let's start in North Carolina at the Four Wide Nationals where the legend John Force is still getting it done. The 72 year old hits nearly 330 miles per hour en route to win number 152 of his career. It's the first time he's won the 4 Y trophy since its inaugural running back in 2010. In fact, he later tweeted he gave Sunday's trophy to track owner Bruton Smith. Good stuff. On the NASCAR side, it was a historic day for Hendrick Motorsports in Dover, Delaware. For the first time, the organization finished first, second, third, and fourth in a race with Alex Bowman taking the trophy at the Monster Mile. It's only the second time in NASCAR's modern era that a team has swept the first four positions in a race. For the IndyCars, the month of May at Indianapolis Motor Speedway began with something of a surprise. 20-year-old Renus VK pushed it three wide at times and then earned his first career victory racing on the road course at the IndyCar Grand Prix. VK is the fifth different winner this year in IndyCar. The young Dutchman now sets his sights on the big prize, the Indianapolis 500. Finally, the World of Outlaws drivers made sure to keep the rivalry with the Pennsylvania Posse a one-sided affair. Yeah, Brad Sweet, Carson Macedo, and Aaron Reitzel each posted victories as the Travelers swept the home state racers in three races at Lincoln and Williams Grove Speedways. Now you're all caught up. For Speed Sport, I'm Alan Kavana. This was your Gas and Go presented by Cometic Gasket. Is your engine sealed by Cometic? Visit Cometic.com.